right guys, it's Saturday and it's water change day today. So it's a big day. I always do water change on Saturday once a week, some tanks more than that. But I'm gonna show you guys today how I change the 180, how I change the 75, how I change the 75, uh, how I change the 150, and I have another 75 there. And of course, don't forget the pond. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do water changes. I got a lot of water changes that are coming. And what I usually do with my water changes is I take them, I take a hose, I put it out in the back. So I recycle the water, I reuse the water, so that way it's better for the environment that way. So in one, two, three, here we go. Using a 3,000 gallon per hour pump, hose is out in the backyard. It's a one inch, 50 foot hose. So now next, as the water is draining out, I like to be a little smart, I keep everything down below, is I'm gonna grab my python, this is gonna be the fresh water coming into the tank. Now you may ask, how much water I drain? Uh, there's a tape right here that measures about how much water I drain, but I'm gonna do a bigger water change today. I'm gonna drain all the way down to the bottom, and then we're gonna see what happens, but I'm gonna hook the fresh water up so I can make this process a little faster, and you're gonna see a speed version of this. Okay, on a pond tank, filters are maintenance. Pond's filling up, as you guys can see. Water's almost there, light's still on. So every week I do a massive water change in this tank, but today was just cleaning filters, 
cleaning all that muck out, all that stuff. And the difference between pond filters and regular FX4 or FX6 is the fact that pond filters use pressure. So it actually is a pump pushing the water through so you actually can um, push water through. So it's a little bit different. So the pond's done. It's almost full. And always subscribe. Thanks for listening. Ron Johnson, mental health coach and therapist. Thank <laughs> you.